time we go back up. Back up to there. What was that? <laughs> it's <a> pricey shit. <laughs> no. Oh, jaybreak, get him the gobbles. Yeah. Now. Nah, we're gonna go back up towards the boat ramp and go back up to the, ri uh, the river that way. So, got, yeah. got quite a bit of more uh, public up that way. So, yeah. There's, is that a boat coming right towards us? Yes. Flying. Well, let's go. Let's go find that one. Oh, that's from that tournament. I like it. Wind's in good, don't it? Yeah. It's better for fall time though. You can lay in a pile of leaves and nobody ever sees. What about them khaki pants though? Stick out like a sore dick. <laughs> <laughs> look like a look like a bedded doe sitting there. <laughs> uh, look like a big log laying there. Big as them legs are. That was definitely a gobble dude. dude. He's right there in the dude, hall. He's right there. Dude, we need to hit this little point. Shoot. Can't believe he was close. <laughs> dude, he's as flat as a That's an island. It's an island. Is it? We just have to get on it and call. He has nowhere to go. God, that was close, man. Right there in that holler. I don't know how we can get. To, I don't know. Should we go on the other side of the track? I'm scared of the park. Well, yeah, I don't want to park right there. Oh, Definitely not. Go back over there and go get on the other side of it. Yeah. We'll show you guys on the map. This turkey is on an island. And where he's at, if we park, try to go up. He's gonna see us, so we're gonna have to drive around him and then work our way up. Let's make oh, he's close. Let's yeah, go. let's go. Come on. Can you believe he's that close? Dude, I he, wasn't expecting that at all. No, I he's. Was, I was trying to listen hard for that. Dude, he had one of them gobbles too. Oh yeah, <laughs> like he's that. So close, I heard it. Yeah, he had that vibration gobble, son. Yeah, he should be. He should be right here in this holler. Hell, we might see him. Ain't that crazy, dude? He's on an island. The guy. I mean, not crazy. I think we park down here on this point and go up. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Get on that point and go to the top. I think he's right there on that flat. He ain't going nowhere, man. It's an island. Oh, 
don't need to get fly it. But yeah, but that's what I'm saying. Unless we spook him, he's not just going to fly it. Caught me off guard. That's for sure. We, well, we heard. I thought we heard one way off, that, that and then he, nice. and then he just cut loose, and we was like, okay. Which he might have heard the one that was way off, and that fired him up. He ain't gobbling at them dang crows or nothing. He gobbled you, did he? No, it was. If he did, it was a delay. Scared him. Golly, dude! More than morning. I mean, I ain't gonna say that because it, it probably won't happen, but. Thank you, Lord, for even letting us come out here and get on this thing. I mean, it's... We're going to get to drive, though. Yeah. We're going to hit this point, go to the tip top, and then work down towards him. And, yeah, uh, I think it's either way down. Just hopefully, hopefully get him fired up and he'll come in. But it, I love the fact that he's on an island. I ain't, I've never got a, on a bird on an island. So... We'll try it out anyways. I get right there. Right there. Or where? Oh, that's the boat. Oh, right down there. I'll go, yeah, we'll go to that park. Either way, we gotta go to the top. Either way. Yeah. Let's go. Look, he's, he's in a spot we know where. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes we get on these birds and we're worried they're gonna go up, up on up in the mountain, you know, up above the mountain or they're going somewhere. This bird's not going nowhere. I mean, they're, gonna be, they're gonna be on this island all morning. Probably all day. Yeah, but how else are we gonna go about it? We should maybe get up there and then hook that left side. Kind of like go around. I really wish you would go up on this hole. I don't want to. It says wherever we call, be wherever we sit. No, I know. We might get up here and then really get up there and kindly go around the left side. I wouldn't think so. Let's go. Wait, wait let's ease. We'll stop and listen for scratching. And we'll slow. Maybe go to the right. We get that crest that hill, we're gonna crawl up and just crawl up and sit. Kind of right there where that, that tree where leaned that over. Tree if we can get up there, we'll crawl and just sit If we do call him in, he pops up, you'll be able to, he'll be in range. I'm thinking he's over the hill though. I'm thinking we're alright.
to get right there to that stone. What do you think? Call before we get there. He's up there. We can at least try him right here. <clears throat> Let's at least try him. Is that what it was? Dang deer just took off. Running back towards where the turkey just gobbled. That one right up there, to your right. He sounded pretty far when he gobbled it. I thought so. I feel like we get right up there and get on, like get on to him, see if he'll gobble. Then again, it looks like it drops straight off to him, might be. Yeah, but he's he's closer than what we thought. Probably right here where we're at. Yeah. I mean, if he pops up right here, he's good. If he pops up down there, you can kill him. Yeah. Yeah. Hear him drumming right in front of us. Did you not hear him drumming? Yeah, to the left, just a little. I think so.
behind this. Now he's the left of this thing. You see? Now he's the left of this. Is he behind this beech tree? down this side right here to the right. Oh you're all seen before me. That beach is going to be in my way. I hope, I hope the right for the video. Seriously, stand up. And that's just, we were in a bad spot. That beach tree was right in the way. Dude, he was standing right there at not even five yards. I couldn't do nothing. I know. Well, we honestly. shifted. Honestly, we should have we should have just sat there and let him cluck. He'd have backed a while, backed out, and we could have circled him again. I don't know. He probably wouldn't have come in the second time. I almost could have shot him down there, but I was like, was he running? Yeah. By himself. He was by himself. Dang it! You guys see where we were sitting up at? I was right here on the left side of this, and he literally pops up right, right there. Not even five yards. He's right here. Dang, this beech tree killed us, man. That tree just killed us. If When we heard him gobble, if we would have set up right there on that beach, or anywhere, really. Bad break. Still a good hunt though. Yeah, it should have been a dead bird. I mean, we caught him in five yards. Just a bad setup, really. Ten yards. It would have been a good setup if he would have come across the top because it would have been like a, what, 18, 20 yard shot. Yeah. Or if he'd have come around the right side, it would have been a good, it would have been a good setup. It just, he caught us off guard. I mean, it's straight off right there too, ain't it? Dang it, dude. I know, why'd he have to come to the left side of the beach? He could, if he'd have come to the right, he'd have been perfect for you and me. I mean, he'd come dead in line with this freaking, like where I must have been sitting, he must have come. Well, it was in my way too, because I'd never seen him come up until he peeked around the side of it from five yards. Well, we're going to use our way back down this, this top and get back to the boat and see if we can go around, drive around to some more public and see if we can strike up another bird. That should have been a freaking easy double. Yeah, that would have been nice. Yeah, that would have been. We'd have been dreaming <laughs> if something like that happened. Something bad had to was bound to happen. Oh, it was almost just bad break. <sighs> Thing about these heels, just gotta you gotta set up just right. And these heels ain't meant for a good video either, because usually it's their head popping up and you you better make a decision quick if 
you, I mean, you only seen eight inches of him. and Yeah, for a total of maybe three seconds. Yeah, there's no way I was going to see him. And then even when I lift it up, he went out the wrong way. If he just would have went straight right. It would have it even worked if he had went on the right side of the beach. You know what I mean? It just, it all fell into I'm play for he, his favor. When he freaked out, if he would have just went straight right, I could have killed him. Yeah. He just went perfect. I mean, he went right out right. I mean, we probably could have sat still for a minute and let him, let him putt and walk off. But, but then over. he'd have been boogered for. He'd have been over with either way. Yeah. down the lake and I've seen some other hunters that was going back towards the way we just come or going towards the way we was gonna go so we're kind of starting to feel like they, they probably already checked this area down through here so I think we're gonna run back to the boat and just go somewhere else by land um, we're just not feeling most confident right now so we're gonna run back and see if we can't make something happen midday but should be good. I mean, we're gonna go some spots we know there's always been birds, so hopefully they're fired up this year. We'll catch on a little bit. All right, back at the truck. We're gonna, like we said, we're gonna go to this other property and uh, see if we can't get on some birds. And then hopefully our papa killed one this morning with our brother. He was gonna go. And uh, there's been birds there every day, so. We'll see if we can't, see how many birds running wild can get on the ground today. See if we can uh, try a little midday walk. Yeah. I think we get one struck up, we got a good chance, but y'all stay tuned. Lazalonian is here with us today. Decided to join us a little late in the day. Just got off work. We had a good morning, caught in two birds, killed one. Now it's time to go find a midday bird. It's about 10 o'clock. See if we can't strike one. Actually, it's 1038, so we'll see if we can't strike one. What do you got in your shirt? My uh, gloves. Accurate. Yeah. Here. What you got there, Laszlo? Nothing. <laughs> 44. Won't shoot it. Check it out. I used to have old stub nose 38. Just love nose. Be easy now. Why is the serial number scratched out? Hey, don't ask questions you don't want to know the answer to. Oh, I'm going. Oh, my hand up there. Tell, tell them what we're doing. We're gonna make it to the top of this ridge line. Everything on the back side is just woods. There's typically turkeys hanging around these flats down through here. There's a bunch of ridges. We're gonna get up here and make our first call. And if we don't hear nothing, we're just gonna work out the top of the ridge. Hopefully hear one.
Yeah, I about guarantee it. Sure, that time.
There's three. There's three. Two more. Yeah, they're gone. They're gone. They split off. Dude. Holy crap. Luckily, I seen him, man. Oh, dude. If I wouldn't have seen him, they would have busted us. They was coming, like, uh, running. Yeah, man. Oh, my goodness. What about that? I see you running. It's out. <laughs> oh, man. This is a Let's go. That happened so fast. We didn't even listen, guys. We were walking down this ridge line. And these turkeys didn't say a word, didn't gobble or nothing. We get all the way down towards the end of the street and we start to run out of room. And we hit a call. I didn't hear nothing. I'm sitting there. I thought I heard something going. I looked over at Dax and I was like, I think I heard them going until they kind of just stopped and listen. And then it wasn't like 20 seconds. Brax and looks over and sees him, sees him running. And all we can do is just hit the ground. Yeah, so we just all kind of squat down and we can't even get on trees. And he just comes up, and I'm to the left of Braxton, and so unfortunately we couldn't have a stand, and I don't know if we got a good on video, but I mean I kind of had to shoot him at 20 yards, and it's just working his way, and then that big bull here, got to kill us all right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we thought it was by itself, but we know as soon as, soon as he shot, two more flew off. It just happened. No, it it happened so fast. We didn't have time to just take what we were doing. That was up there. Let's look at it. That beard. Oh yeah. That's a real good thing. Shark spurs. That's a lot of stuff. Big black spurs. Pretty fine. What a day it's been, man. Three, three boats, actually six boats caught in. We can't the clip it's come in. This has been one of the most, like the least build up I've ever been on. Oh, I know. This is the widest turkey hunt. We just went to a hill. <laughs> just walk in. And a total years. of probably a, a minute from the time we heard him that second time that we for sure heard him. And then they wouldn't gobble no more because they were freaking running to us. And they came from this to come from going to you. Yeah, I mean, like, they were down there in that bottom and just come straight, or maybe in the bottom, they would just be on out the ridge and just come yeah. straight out. <sighs> Thank you, Lord, for the day. Two birds, actually three birds, because I packed up three of You guys will see that food, because my brother is with him, so. and it's just now 11.30. It's just now 11.30. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that was Easy now. Got the I mean, it's just now midday. So, what did we say it was? Eleven? I can't. I can't remember. Eleven fifty. So it's just now getting eight o'clock midday. Well, guys, that's gonna be it for opening day. We've been at it since about four thirty. Four thirty this morning. And it's time to go home and get some rest and be ready to get back after it in the morning because. Lazo is up to shoot and we're going to a spot where we killed two birds last year so we know there's birds there because we left some to live so hopefully tomorrow just keeps on rolling and we're going to move on to Kentucky here hopefully in the next week or two so y'all stay, stay tuned.